Hi parents, hi kids. If you plan on taking a walk to enjoy the foliage this fall, maybe go on a hike, and you're interested in learning some botany, then stick around. I have a cool app for plant identification and some fun activities you can do with your kids. Hi parents, hi kids. Okay, so I'm gonna show you this app that my sister-in-law recommended. You know, when I take my kids out for walks, if I wanna show them the trees or the plants, I have no idea uh, how to identify anything. So I found this app after looking at a few. I think this is probably the best one for the money. You can just take a picture, connects to the network, and then it will give you an ID. You can go home and then figure out how correct that is. So this is Plant Snap. And what we did was we went on a walk. Um, we live in New England. And I was able to uh, take pictures of various leaves. Uh, same thing in our backyard. We could take pictures of uh, the flowers and plants we're growing, that are growing. This app provides uh, information on regional location. So this is a great way to figure out if, if it's actually identifying what you're looking at correctly. You know where you live, so um, I can determine. I obviously hydrangea is an easy one. So I use that, and this is where you take the picture. You hit snap, and then these are some flowers from my backyard. So you know this particular flower. I know what it looks like. It grows in my front lawn, and. Um, I thought that would be an easy one to do, and I knew even though Plant Snap is saying it's this black eyed Susan, I know it wasn't. I know what these plants look like, and it is this orange coneflower. So I could share that with my kids. These are located in New England. Yeah, it's nice. That's good. So then we went around the yard and took pictures of various plants that we have, and um, now this one is very interesting. This is a very pretty uh, weed, I guess. So I went online to confirm what this is. And we definitely have, they look like little blueberries, Mexican poke weed. And what's interesting about this is that when I looked online, I found that these uh, berries are okay for birds to eat but they're toxic to mammals so this is something I want to keep away from my kids I guess this is also something to keep in mind for the family pet if you have a dog or a cat hopefully they instinctively know not to eat these kinds of berries um, all right I hope you have an opportunity um, to download this app and use it um, and you have a great day